YouTube and uh, well, I do have something to say about what ha you know what happened to me this two days. Alright, if you're wondering why that sound is very something, we was in two days of hell. We had really bug out. I mean, the real bug out. Alright. These lame neighbors of ours had tried to do a terrorist attempt on our lives. We had endured two days of hell because Hazmat was here. Not in this apartment, but next door. Um, the lame attempt of these people trying to kill us didn't work. They're in more trouble than what it's worth to them. Us, we had a door two days of complete hell. We couldn't be here. We couldn't sleep in our own bed. We couldn't come back to feed our cats. Now, the details of this as I'm just going to tell you, these guys had left material down in the basement of the next door. See, we're going to be moving next door. And these lame people said that they were going to get back at us for having them kicked out. And the reason one is these people did not pay their rent. No. They didn't pay their rent. And the landlord was pretty pissed off. At them. So, this is what happened prior to what went on. Um, I woke up one morning. There was arguing. There was fighting. Um, I mean, some really arguing. We called up the landlord to tell these people are arguing. They're, they're probably trashing the place. And the landlord said, Oh, they're probably mad at me because I gave them a, you know, a five-day eviction notice. And they only had five days to get out. Or come up with the money. That's all they had to do. But no, they bolt to Florida left some material behind some hazard material thinking that the gases would have killed us they couldn't kill a wet paper bag our cats didn't die we did not die we would just endure two days of hell because we couldn't come back here But we slept in some pretty good motels. The Holiday Inn was excellent. We just came back from the Holiday Inn today. This is the first time I've been home. And I promised Helena this will never happen again. Now, if people let me do my job, I could have took out these two damn fucking terrorists. I could have done. I could have done that. I could have saved the world a whole bunch of heartache. But these people are on the terrorist list now. Not on the FBI terrorist list, but on Hazma's terrorist list. Because Hazma had to come out here and clean. And one also from the big New York. We're small New York. The big New York had came here to supervise the little New York's hazmat team. I 
I don't want no one to go through this two days of hell like we did. Because it was lame. It was a lame terrorist attempt. And you can see we even have in-home terrorists in our own country. And these people would do a lot of things. And these people, I hope they get caught by law. I hope they extradite them back down here so I can look them in the face and laugh. <laughs> I'll laugh at them. And plus, over top of that, they have drug charges. That's all I'm going to say about this. But the lame terrorist attempt that they did was so lame. It cost me a little bit of my training. Which, don't worry, YouTube. There'll be more of uh, Nijitsu training from Black Soul Shinobi Dojo. And. That's why I hadn't been on. I think these people need to really be caught. I mean, I lost sleep. I lost a little bit of my life. Just a little. But it's not as much as the other people are going to be. Yeah. <laughs> They're going to get the full strength of the law. And that's all for the day. I'm sorry I had to do endure your two minutes of hell. Seeing my face looking like, Hey man, he's a little sleepy. Yeah, I am a little sleepy. I just had to get up at 8 o'clock this morning. I usually don't get up until I 11. And then get up and do some exercises and train. And two days cost me two days of training. Because I could have had the um, fourth uh, Kamai up. Or the fifth Kamai up. And that's Joe Dan. Ichiman no Kamai. Which I'm going to have it soon. I'm going to put it up soon. And... Peace out, my ninjas. And that's all for today's thing. I'm glad to be back home. I'm glad to be able to talk to you guys. You know, I'm not really a bad person that the haters make me out to be. But let me tell you. And you have to endure two days of hell. You'd be glad to sleep in your own bed. Bug out situations only for emergencies only. And if it's not an emergency, don't bug out. If it is, go ahead and bug out. I had a bug out. Couldn't carry none of my weapons. Just my computer, myself, girlfriend. A little bit of clothes and maybe the stuff on my back. That's a real bug out situation. Peace out, my ninja.